So here we are in After Effects CC 2019. I have a project ready to render. And I want to output it as an H264 format or MP4. However, when I go to the format option, you can see that the H264 format is missing from the drop down menu. To fix this, we need to download and install the Epsilon codec. I'm going to open up my web browser and navigate the Epsilon codec website. You can find the link to the website in the video description below. Once you are on the website, scroll down to find download section. There is two different options based on your operating system. Make sure to choose the correct version that corresponds to your Epsilon FX installation. In my case, I'm using Windows. So I will click on the window download link. The plugin will start downloading and it may take a few moments depending on your internet connection. Once the download is complete, locate the downloaded file on your computer and double click on it to begin the installation process. The installation wizard will guide you through the installation process. Simply follow the on-screen instruction and make sure to read any additional information that may be provided. Apps codec will be installed on your computer and once the installation is complete, you can close the installation user. Now that we have After Codec installed, let's go back to After Effects and check if H264 format is available for rendering. I will go ahead and select the desired composition in the render queue, then click on the output module setting to open the format option. And look at that. The H264 format is now available in the drop down menu. This means we can now render our project as an H264 file using After Codec. You can adjust parameters such as video codec, quality, bitrate, resolution, and more based on your specific requirement. Take your time to customize the setting to achieve the desired output. Once you are satisfied with the setting, click OK to close the format option menu. Make sure the desired output location is selected in the output to fill. You can choose to render a specific folder or use the default location. Now it's time to render. Click on the render button in the render queue panel and After Effects will start rendering your project as an H.264 or MV4 file format using After Effects plugin. The rendering process may take some time depending on the complexity of your composition and the length of your project. Grab a cup of coffee and sit back while After Effects work its magic. Congratulations, After Effects has successfully rendered your project to the H.264 format using After Codec plugin. That end our tutorial on how to render After Effects CC in project to the H.264 file format using After Codec. I hope you found this tutorial helpful. If you have any question, feel free to leave them in the comment section below. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more exciting tutorial and Adobe After Effects and other creative software. Thank you for watching and see you in the next video.